The race for a competitive Wisconsin congressional district is already heating up, with one candidate jumping into the race this week, more than a year ahead of her primary election. Political reporter Will Keneally has more on what the race is looking like. She'll be a familiar face in western Wisconsin. Rebecca Cook ran in last year's Democratic primary. And she's launching a new campaign this week, hoping to unseat Wisconsin's newest congressman. Famously, Democrats have been struggling in rural Wisconsin, and Republicans continue to gain momentum in rural parts of this state. And Democratic candidate Rebecca Cook sees herself as a possible solution, according to UW Lacrosse political scientist Anthony Chergosky. Rebecca Cook was able to establish herself as someone who could speak to the concerns of rural residents. And that really became the cornerstone of her campaign. Support in that part of the state was a big issue for local Democrats last fall, who wanted to see the National Party step in with more support. State Senator Brad Paff ran for the seat last year, and Chagoski says he may be considering not running this year because of that lack of support. And one of the considerations for Brad Paff is if he would want to give up his state Senate district in order to seek the House of Representatives seat. Paff was the Democratic opponent of Derek Van Orden, the Republican who flipped the long Democratic seat last fall. Derek Van Orden had a significant financial resource advantage compared to Brad Paff. I think a lot of candidates who are potentially interested in running here are going to be very curious about what the Democratic Party might or might not do this time around. Now there is one other name being floated for the seat. Wisconsin's Economic Development Secretary, Missy Hughes, is said to be considering a run as well. Reporting from the Capitol, Will Keneally, News 3 Now.